Dito tayo sa Ay! 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 expect nga ganun po siya kaganda kasi sa picture nakikita namin isa lang siyang play na lugar actually marami siyang sites na pwede namin puntahan kahit sa ganito lamang kaliit na area sa kanilang camp ano yung ini-expect mo dito ganda <laughs> siya ah, uh, uh, maganda uh, maganda parang So, ito na. Papasok na tayo. Oh, let's walk. Ganda, oh. Yawn. Yawn. <laughs> so, dito po. Dito nila entertain yung mga naka-reserve na, na mga customers. So, dito po yung kanilang reception hall. Sa reception hall pa lang po, klarong-klaro na yung field, tsaka yung mga cabins, even their ano, barang swing pool, their view deck, tsaka may tarpaulin sila doon, may tent, tsaka yung isang available na Aben. Uh, uh, <laughs> display. May mga tables din silang nakaset. If ever uh, gusto kayong kumain dyan. Kasi sa loob ng mga cabins walang area for dining. So, dito talaga sila sa labas. Alright. So, sa isang destinasyon ng Supremacy Camp, pupuntahan natin yung kanilang Garden of Flowers. second destination which is the cabin in cabin number one nila wow! and ito yung cabin nila aakyatin nga natin
Ayan. Ang ganda. At ito yung loob. I think uh, chair lang to. Maliit lang siya. Parang tree house. Ito yung dining area. May isang cabin. Mayroon silang grill doon. Kung gusto nila ang mag barbecue. Kasi of course, camp na, diba? So what's the purpose? Bruh. Ayan, this is their grill. Bibili lang kayo ng firewood. So, dito naman is yung campfire. Dito tayo mag-kumbaya. Kumbaya. Kasama mo si mga friends nyo. Nagkaganyan. Marshmallows. Uh, hot dog. Barbecue. Pwede rin. <laughs> is the cabin that we will be staying tonight. The cabin includes this uh, somewhat mess hall and together with this grill we're gonna have barbecue tonight. Diba <laughs> webs? Mm. <laughs> we're here at our dining table. Here's our cabin. It's cute but a bit bigger compared to sa isa. And look at the view behind me. Wow! Tayo sa ating maliit na cabin. Uh, <laughs> ang cute niya po. So, pasok tayo. This is a very nice place po. Parang it's very cozy. I would really love to consider uh, being here. Or maybe owning a house one day sa mountain region. It's really nice, peaceful, and the breeze is really, really cool kahit na maaliwalas po siya. O, papasok na po tayo sa cabin. Okay. So, yan yung mga snacks natin. Wala silang table dito sa loob. At nandito yung inyong senior gorilla. <laughs> Maliit lang siya. So, pagpasok namin, nandito na yung four na bean bags. I don't know why it's stored here. It's eating up space, pero okay lang naman. Hindi namin masyado ginagamit yung half ng room. Dito lang kung saan kami matutulog. Yan yung ating setup para mamaya. And then, may electricity naman po dito. May light. Kaso walang electric fan. Siguro kasi cool yung temperature dito. So, I would really consider uh, living in a house this small. I think perfect lang po siya. If medyo mataas yung kanyang ano, uh, walls para naman makapag ano tayo dito ng loft doon yung bed tsaka sa ibaba naman yung pwedeng uh, dining room or dining area or living room the place is really good I like the cabin hindi naman siya mainit maliwalas naman hindi siya mainit kasi nandun yung mga jealousy marami siyang jealousy I don't know lang paggabi kung ano yung experience namin dito, kung marami bang lamok o wala. So ngayon, magla-lunch po kami. Kaso hindi kami nakapag-prepare ng, ano, ng putahe sa lunch. So yung mga dinadala lang namin na snacks, yung kakainin namin. <laughs> Mamaya na po yung kainan. Ito lang po yung aming lunch. Kung ano-ano na lang. Naligo po tayo kasi... 
Gusto ko lang maligo. And natry ko po yung kanilang tubig. Sobrang lamig. Parang ice water yung ano yung tubig nila. super lamig <laughs> hindi namin in expect na ganun makalamig but it was a nice type of coolness po Satisfactory. Actually, nanghihinaya nga ako dahil I'm using a mobile phone instead of a camera. Wala pa kasi akong camera. The view of the city is really breathtaking when uh, 
it's night time makikita mo talaga yung lights yung buong syudad sa baba as in klarong klaro yung view doon I'm just really sad that I didn't caught it on video tsaka pag magpifilm ako ng gabi hindi masyado visible yung ating pinapakita dahil walang masyadong lights dito aside lamang sa aming cabin at dito pero hindi naman ganun ka bright yung ring light ko hindi ko rin magamit ng lubos kasi uh, hindi siya ganun mag illuminate ng isang buong area uh, focus lang talaga yung coverage niya So, yung ratings po ng cam, ilalagay lamang namin sa description box below. So, do check it out. Tsaka, I would like to announce pala when our, our channel reaches 100 subscribers, magkakaroon po tayo ng raffle worth 100 pesos load. Ilalagay ko lamang yung mechanics sa description box lang din para naman ma-aware kayo kung ano yung mga gagawin para manalo. Yung experience ko last night, is very good. Okay naman po. Uh, may pumapasok lang nakakaibang mga insekto na hindi ko pa nakita ever since pero it wasn't that harmful. Ano, they were just visiting kasi may light. Na-attract sila sa light. Pero when it comes to mosquitoes I'm very very happy na walang mosquito kagabi. Bumili pa naman kami ng off lotion kasi nga inagala namin na maraming lamok. Although yung nagbabother lang sa amin is yung lamig as in hindi namin ini-expect na ganun talaga siya kalamig I think this is what it's like to be here in the mountains, mga kabukiran and I really love the experience na pag-usapan nga namin kanina ni Lalabs na someday kung ano, pagpalain mo kami ng panahon bumibili kami ng lupa dito sa ganitong mga area kasi it's very peaceful number one talaga very peaceful relaxing tapos yung breeze nya nakaka relax po talaga this is actually my first time experiencing being exposed sa ganito karaming puno ganito karaming mga halaman kasi never pa akong nakatry mag overnight sa isang lugar kagaya dito Actually, nasanay ako sa syudad, whereas sobrang init, walang mga puno, may halaman nga, pero hindi masyado ganoon karami. So, I'm very thankful po that I get to experience this kind of getaway in the wild. <laughs> Ika nga, wild eh. Overall, 10 out of 10 po siya para sa akin, kasi the view is actually worth it. This is actually my first time seeing a type of view like this pero kapag like the now naman yung pag-uusapan I cannot judge or compare them yet kasi I went to like the now only once batang bata pa ako dun uh, may marami mang changes as far as I'm aware sa pinapakita sa social media pero I really can't tell what it's like actually when you go there kasi nga yung expectations namin sa lugar na ito maliit lamang at saka isa lang siyang plain na place pero kung yung pagpunta namin marami naman pala siyang sightings na gusto mong ma-try or ma-experience uh, the only problem lang is that hindi kami makakalabas kapag gabi na I really want to experience or to go to other places here in Milagro pero we really don't know what other sites are stored in for us so, but we actually set our plans only to supremacy camp but it was still worth it we still enjoyed our stay here and i would like to thank you all for tuning in again to cabbage 3ph i really appreciated all your efforts and support till next time mm -hmm.